Out in the tropics, we are tracking a couple of areas, a new feature being highlighted by the National Hurricane Center in the Western Caribbean and Aaron. Let's start with the one closer to home, though. This may grab your attention. It's an unorganized tropical wave with some intermittent showers this morning, certainly not organizing. It'll be moving into Mexico today, and so it won't organize today, but it'll merge in the southwest Gulf Thursday and Friday. May have a brief opportunity to try to wrap up. Now, one thing for sure, this moisture is going to be heading towards near Mexico and maybe even into South Texas. So you can see Thursday you've got some showers and storms trying to organize struggling somewhat and then that moisture moving into northern Mexico and South Texas later Thursday into Friday. It is no threat to the New Orleans or Louisiana area. Here's the latest on tropical storm Aaron as of the 4 a.m. advisory maintaining 45 mile per hour winds. It's slowing down some that will allow this thing to actually organize now and it's moving into warmer water temperatures. So when you look at it on satellite, it does actually have some showers and storms. Now the current forecast, they've bumped down the intensity timeline some, showing it remaining a tropical storm through today and tomorrow. But we still think it's our first hurricane by Thursday night into Friday. And then that's when things still ramp up. Now the latest cone does take it near or just north of the islands. Going to be really close here for Puerto Rico and the Virgin Islands by this weekend. So they're monitoring it. Hopefully it passes north of the islands and you can see they're starting to get more latitude by early next week, maybe as a major hurricane. Turks and Caicos really keeping an eye on this as well, but we do still think that turn is going to happen. When you look at our tropical models here, they all agree that it's going to be near or just north of the islands by this weekend. And then there's the turn to the north by Monday and Tuesday. Bermuda really keeping an eye on this. East Coast still watching it, but we're still feeling okay. Okay, here in the United States with what we're seeing right now. So our seven